Hey guys, this is Tyler from Two Guys in the Saw Props, and today we're going to be going over my Rotocaster that I built. Now, as you can see, it's about one and a half feet workspace for whatever mold you put into it. It's made by two by ones, uh, no, one by fours that were ripped on a band or on a table saw, and then put together in a box inside of a box design. Now, the motor here is bought on Amazon. The pulse width modulator, I think you call it, was bought on Amazon also. And what powers it is a computer power supply, which was also bought on Amazon. Uh, the guys that came up with the motor, I think they're out of California, and they're awesome. Like They will literally call you back within five minutes, and that's off Amazon, so that's pretty awesome all the gearings and belts which there's one belt an angle gear mechanism and two pulleys that have teeth on them so they can grab the belt that's all found on either Granger. i'll post the link uh, actually i'll post the link to the whole tutorial that i followed online it just needs some tweaking from what's seen on the tutorial because it kind of didn't work that well right off the bat but it's it's a learning experience. Honestly, when I get my welder, I'll probably make a big metal one and just weld it together instead of using wooden screws. But it can go up to 50 revolutions a minute. And honestly, I use 65D, so that has a curing time of about 15 minutes. So it just does this for 15 minutes while I go do some other thing, which is awesome because I don't have to sit there and turn it by hand. It also has a counterbalance on this side to counterbalance all this good stuff on this side. And it also can fold up. I got the feet so they collapse in and I can take it on the road with me just in case I do panels and want to show it to people. But yeah, I'll put the link to the tutorial and where to get all the goodies in the description so you guys can get the same thing. Thank you for following me and hit that subscribe button if you want to keep up with all the good stuff that we're doing in the shop. The next video will probably be something with Velociraptor eggs, so stay tuned. Thanks.